race sports cars like these, they become alive on a track like this. You always drive above 300, 330 kilometers per hour, and you're, you're flying through there. It's like a, like a roller coaster that you want to do again and again. <laughs> Years. Technology evolved so fast that if there were no regulations, a human being wouldn't be physically able to drive the car because the car would go so fast. For me, it's been a long, long journey just within the Audi family since my first race uh, with them in, in, in 2000. Uh, here at Le Mans. This year we are running the Audi R18, the e-tron Quattro, uh, with the hybrid technology. A lot of people don't know, but the R18 Quattro is a complete new car. There's not one bit that has been carried over from the R18 Ultra. The aerodynamics have been improved with a lot more efficiency. The engine power has been uh, improved. Uh, the hybrid system, of course, got more power and better efficiency as well. So there are a lot of small things that make the car as a whole much better. So the R18 is so quick when you're driving that car, every time that you're inside the car, every time you accelerate out of a corner or you go into a fast corner, you just say, wow, this is awesome. Even when you are in reality in the car, when you are in the quick corners, you just think that's not possible. It cannot be quick like that. The thing I love about the R18 is that it's functioning before form. It's meant to be fast. It's all about speed. It has to work within these regulations, but it's able to eke every little bit of performance out of its weight, its aero, and its engine. All of that while pushing all new technology that'll eventually make its way onto the road. It's always small steps, fine tuning, detail work, and it's constantly going on. Every time the cars roll out on the track, it gives us feedback, and the engineers, they don't sleep. And uh, this combination, and in this passion, uh, teamwork and, and technology progress. Teamwork is the key part of making a game like Forza. Turn 10 is a much stronger team than they were five years ago, 10 years ago. We've learned so much. We have a huge team working on very specialized, different components. They have to be able to have the freedom to innovate, come up with their own ideas, while still staying true to where we want to go as a larger vision. We bond as a team very, very well with my teammates and the mechanics. So we make sure we, we are in this bubble where we feel really strong and all the pressure from outside doesn't, doesn't affect us so, and we can deliver the purest performance. My love is also the teamwork and the team spirit you have within a group of people trying to optimize a car by unbelief. Obviously, we're designing a race car in general and the R18 in particular. You have so many areas of specialists that you need, that you have to work in a team. One guy can never cover all of them. Having a partner like Audi allows us behind the curtain access to test data, to all of their engineering and how they actually build an amazing car like the R18. Our goal is to recapture the, the fear and the precision and the mastery of driving a car like the R18 on a track like Le Mans. We have this beautiful game running at 1080p, 60 frames per second. The cloud enables us to change the game all the time. New content coming into your world so players can be immersed in the light, the violence, the feeling of racing. Now everyone can share the passion of, of driving this car on a very, very high technology level at home. And uh, I hope that they will be just as fascinated as I am when my blood and adrenaline is pumping when I'm sitting behind the wheel in the Monaco. When you stand on top of that podium, uh, you, first of all, you're proud of what you did and to share this with your mates. And to stand on top of this, you, you look at each other and say, wow, oh, we did it. And I think there's no podium like this in the world. This is really passionate work. It's not only driving. To see your car uh, to be with your name on it, on the game like that, it's just, it's awesome. You know, when you were a kid, it's still the reaction of the kids I know. 
I say, oh, that's your car. Your car is in the game. That's awesome. And this, this is really nice.